What is going on everyone? Welcome back to another video. I hope you're all well. I'm super excited to share this video with you. Those of you that follow me on Instagram will know that I've recently partnered up with American Express and I've just been on a trip to Iceland with them. I went to go and visit my friends Ben and Amy and stay with those guys and kind of get up to loads of different things out there which I'm going to be sharing with you in just a minute. So for this trip, we actually wanted to go to destinations that we hadn't been to before in Iceland. Obviously, I've been quite a few times, Alexi's been a couple of times, so we kind of wanted to change it up and kind of go on a bit of a different adventure. So I'd actually never been to the West Peninsula before, Peninsula before, so we decided to take a road trip out west and kind of head to one of our main destinations, Snarfels Nest, uh, which is super iconic kind of location, big mountain, amazing waterfalls. So let's go and see what happened there. What is going on, everyone? Welcome to Iceland. For the next five days, Alex and I are going to be roaming around, exploring, getting some pictures and experiencing some very cool things like this behind us. It's going to be an epic trip. I'm going to bring you guys with me. Let's do this. Yes, Iceland. Little stop off for the day. What's this place called again? Kidkefeld. Kidkefeld? Yeah. Kid, Kidkefeld. So, this is obviously one of the more well known spots in Iceland. I'm sure you guys would have seen this image on the internet and on Instagram and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, definitely one of the more touristy spots. But I'm um, pretty happy with the shot that I got. What do you think, Lex? It's pretty beautiful. It's really nice light at the moment. Super well. nice. It's rained all day, but now the sun is so we've literally had a lot of rain. I think Iceland gets about 200 days of rain in a year, so quite a lot of wet weather. But we persevered, now it's cleared up, and now the light is really super nice. Very, very soft, kind of golden, golden tint. Back on the road? On the road again. this trip and how the American Express British Airways Premium Plus card actually helped me kind of save money for this trip. This card is specifically for collecting Avios points and you guys would have seen on my Instagram that I kind of have been using it to buy things and then kind of collect the Avios points. So for this trip Alex and I actually managed to get rewards flights. So you log into your British Airways account you can see how many Avios you have. So the ones that are on my card transfer directly to my account so I can kind of keep up to date on all of that and kind of see my total of Avios. So for this one what we actually managed to do was we did part payment and we used a chunk of Avios as well. Whenever I got out to Iceland I always hook up with Ben and Amy because they know the country inside out, they're really good friends of mine so they really helped us kind of create this road trip and the destinations that we went to. So the weather in Iceland is pretty unforgiving and this trip was definitely no exception. We had the most crazy rain, crazy wind, one minute we had a rainbow, the next minute we were kind of in torrential rain, it was crazy but you can't let that stop an adventure so we cracked on with the road trip and we actually stayed overnight right by Snaffles Nest and when we woke up we could kind of see the mountain. The audio from this trip, as you'll see in this video, was pretty bad just because the wind was so strong. So I'm gonna be maybe throwing in some subtitles on some of the clips. Good morning, Iceland. This is where we stayed last night.
not hear me, I'll have to subtitle this. But we have come to this amazing kind of lookout point. Beautiful orange lighthouse behind us. It's time to get back on the road. The ocean is looking very rough today. So one of the major benefits for us on this trip is that we actually managed to save a load of money on the flights, as I mentioned. So that kind of put us in a really good position to be able to have a little bit more money to spend on things like eating out and doing all these different experiences and funding the road trip itself. So with us being able to save the money on the flights, it then got us to kind of have a bit of a better experience in the destination itself. So I think that's one of the real benefits that I, I see from this part payment kind of using your Avios as well. So feeling pretty hungry and cold and beaten up by the weather in general, we decided to stop for lunch at this really cool fish and chip restaurant. Um, I can't recommend it enough. There's a really good atmosphere in there and the food was delicious. Um, so yeah, I definitely recommend it. <laughs> Push like a Viking. Uh, a minute. Lunch done, fish and chips was absolutely delicious. The weather is holding out today. It's been a little bit more kind to us today. So the light is out, which is really, really nice. We are dealing with a little bit of rain and wind, but we're still getting it done. How was lunch? So good. Yeah? Warm fish and chips. It's been very windy and rainy today. To arrive at this little, apparently this place used to be a little van and they did so well but now they've got like a little hut and it's so toasty in there. Yeah, it was Coffee, fish and chips, now the beach. So it was an amazing few days being on the road, staying in these kind of unique locations and getting to see parts of Iceland I'd never seen before. Even though it was wet and rainy, we definitely made the most of it um, and got out there and did all the things that we wanted to do. So then we headed back to Ben and Amy's house as we had something cool planned for the next day and our last day of the trip. Good morning, Iceland. Another wet and rainy day. Today is our last day. We're heading into Reykjavik. <laughs> the Blue Lagoon was after those few days of just being absolutely beaten up by the weather. It was a perfect way to end the trip. And like I said, those are the things that we were able to do because we actually saved the money on the flight. So the Blue Lagoon, you know, we probably wouldn't have done that. We've actually never done that before, but having that kind of extra bit of money that you would have spent on flights to be able to use on an experience like that, was massive and it was yeah such a great thing to do before getting on the flights and yeah that was our trip it was so awesome to hang out with Ben and Amy and be on the road with those guys and go to the Blue Lagoon with those guys it was incredible a massive thank you to American Express for partnering up with me on this video we had an amazing trip um, and if you guys are interested in more details about the American Express British Airways Premium Plus card I will link it all in the description below but like I said it is a really really good way like I use this card all the time I use it um, to kind of build up the Avios so I can actually do things like this. And we've got another trip coming up which I'm very excited about. You guys would have heard me talk about one of my number one destinations that I want to go to probably since I started this channel. So Alexia and I are going to be heading to Japan. 
So I cannot wait for the images, for the video that's gonna be coming. That is also in collaboration with American Express, so another shout out to those guys. I cannot wait to share that with you. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Um, give it a thumbs up if you have. Leave me a comment down below what you thought of it, and I'll catch you guys very soon, maybe in Japan. Okay, see you guys, bye-bye.